If I could fit more things in here, there would be more things in here. I'm Pia Mia, are you ready to spill it? So this is my bag, it's Louis Vuitton, it's the Game On collection, and I decided to bring this one today because I got it recently as a Christmas gift, and so this is what I've pretty much been using every day. My bag means a lot to me because I love fashion, and I think pieces like bags or shoes or just the little accessories that you're putting with your outfit make the whole thing. Okay, here we go, I'm gonna go into my bag. Don't judge me. First, I obviously have my phone. Um, this is a phone case I designed with Case Defy. It was really cute. I think it goes with every outfit. And obvious reasons, you need your phone. I've recently been really into blue light and protecting myself from it, so I have these blue light glasses. I just throw these on whenever I'm looking at my phone or watching the TV or at the computer. I have these sunglasses. I just got these when I was last home on Guam. They're Gucci sunglasses. You know, I love to wear a mask and sunglasses, so you can just be super incognito and no judgment, because you can't even see me. The next, I have my bikini. I always keep it in a little Ziploc bag, but I'll just show you what it looks like, because it's so cute. I'm an island girl. You never know when you're gonna hit a beach or maybe hit a pool, so I always have one on me. And I like to keep it in the Ziploc, because if you do use it and it gets wet, it's easy to take back home. And also, it's just, if it was loose, it would be all over the place in my bag, all tangled up, and I don't like that. I have a scrunchie, always gotta have a scrunchie. I don't like using regular hair ties, especially because my hair is blonde and so processed, it kinks really easily. So scrunchies are good because it avoids that. This is something that I always have on me. These cameras, disposable cameras, I love to document my life and just have these moments with my friends. You capture so many moments on here where you're not trying to look perfect or trying to get the best angle. It's just such an in the moment, candid kind of thing. So love these, I always have one on me. And it's fun too, because I always forget to get them developed and then months later you go and it's just like a cute thing to look back on and surprise yourself with. I have an extra mask on me all the time, COVID life. Next I have this Apple iPhone case. It's a charger also. Um, we got Blow Pop, the snack that's not really a snack. Here we go. Here is my wallet. I got this a Christmas ago or a couple of Christmas ago. So this is perfect because both my items are from Christmas and I love it. And it's very easy to use. It's black, it goes with everything. It's as simple as that. I always carry a pen on me and I also always carry a moleskine. I have tried writing in other journals before and I don't know why, but these are just my favorite. I don't know. Gotta jot down your ideas, write a poem, something, get your feelings out. Sometimes you come up with something really good at the most random times and if you don't put it down, you're gonna forget. So you gotta stay you know, prepared. Okay, this one I think is super cute. I also got this, uh, it's a Snoopy planner. I got it also at Christmas. My mom got it for me and it basically just looks like this inside. I jot down just bullet points of what I did that day and if I felt good or bad or like in between. I don't know why I like to document my moods, but I do. We got gum, always gotta have gum. We got hand sanitizer. This one's the Purell two times sanitizing. I like to find the ones that have the two or three times sanitizing just to be extra, extra safe. Next, we have this really cute Hello Kitty compact. I actually saw Nikita using this and so I went and found it because I thought it would be perfect. It has two sides to the mirror. So the top one is a two times magnifying mirror. And then also super cool, it lights up. So you can use this day and night and it's Hello Kitty. Like who doesn't love that? Got my AirPods, of course, um, always listening to music. I have mine labeled with my name on the back. Fun fact, this is my first pair of AirPods I ever got and I have never lost them. And I'm really proud of that because everyone I know is like on their seventh pair and they just can't keep track of it or they only have one of the pods, but I got both. So that's the Virgo in me. I'm very organized. I like to keep my stuff where I know where it is and clean and all that. We have this makeup bag. Um, this is very simple. I use this to travel with and also keep in my bags that will fit it. Here we have some oil pads. These are my favorite ones. I use these all the time. I sometimes like to use oil pads by themselves and not use powder because sometimes when you use powder, you can get a little cakey or sometimes it takes down the pigment in your makeup. Like I never want to affect my blush. So usually I'll just use this if I get a little oily. We have this Chanel perfume. So good. I like this little case too, because it's a twist up, so you don't have to worry about it spilling in your bag. It's very safe to keep inside. And then I have powder for if I am feeling the powder vibes. This is the best nude lip liner I have found that works with my skin tone. And then I have this chapstick. I found this chapstick a few years ago. I've just become obsessed. It's so good. 
It's a little minty, keeps my lips moisturized, and sometimes you know when you use chapstick and then it goes away and your lips feel almost more chapped afterwards, this doesn't do that. So I gotta keep it on me at all times. Cuticle oil is something I love to keep on me. Um, I think, you know, your hands are where it shows your age. So I'm always conscious of moisturizing and using cuticle oil and just trying to keep my skin as fresh as possible all the time. Then here are the two Chanel red lipsticks. Let me show you the difference in tones. This one's a little darker. It's a little more of a moody. Maybe this is gonna be like a nighttime type of lipstick. And then this is a brighter red. So this one I would probably use more daytime and then mix a little bit of this in so it's not too bright if I don't want it to be too intense. But love that, red lipstick can complete an outfit. So red lipstick is like an accessory. It's like a bag. If you're wearing something plain, you just put this on and you're good to go. The last thing in my bag is my tiny horse. I don't know if you can see him very well, but this reminds me of my little sister Paloma. So it's our thing. Over the holidays, this SNL episode, we were watching it. It has Timothy Chalamet and he's singing about this tiny horse. It's hilarious. If you haven't seen it, you should look it up. But anyway, so the whole tiny horse thing comes from that and that's probably just the most weird, interesting, quirky thing that's in my bag. I don't know. If I could fit more things in here, there would be more things in here. That's everything that's in my bag. Thank you for watching Refinery29. To watch more, click here, and to subscribe, click here.